<laughs> Hello, it's Marco here from Markham 3D. I'm currently working on another animated short film, so if you want to check them out, Markham 3D Studios. Now, my EV render's not looking the best, as you can see here. However, I've done a few things to spice it up, and now they're looking like this. Now, I'm not using any light probes. There's only just a few quick settings. Let's go into it. Let's have a short, sharp, straight to the point video. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. So here we are sitting down at the computer. This is what we have at the moment. I mean, it's okay, not really. There's no shadows underneath the trees if we just kind of have a squeeze around the scene. You can really see that there's no shadows. And it's looking rather flat. So from here, what I'm gonna do first thing is I've already turned on ambient occlusion, but let's add some settings. The distance, I'm gonna bump up to about 40. What? 20. That's a little bit better. The next thing I'm going to increase screen space refractions, reflections, sorry, and trace position. We'll base this up to one just to make it look a little bit schmicker. And the other thing is let's come down into color management. Let's change the look. I'm going to go high contrast. And there we go. That now makes it really pop. Now with the ambient occlusion, you can kind of see, I think that's a little bit too much still. So let's just change that to maybe 10. There we go, that's a little bit better. It kind of follows the camera angle. So it doesn't matter where the sun is, you can kind of see those um, shadows rotating. But anyway, I just quickly wanted to show you that. So hopefully your renders now clean up and look a little bit better with Eevee. Yeah, I don't know, we'll find out. Post your comments below, let me know if this worked, if it looks nice, or what's the general consensus about it. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button, it really helps me out and keeps updating my content. And this short film will hopefully be coming out within the week. So jump back over to Markham 3D Studios, go check it out, make sure you subscribe over there, watch all the shorts, why not, let's build it up. I am planning a mini series.